For the last four days, United Kingdom-based artist Mr. Sens has been hard at work on his latest piece of art. It's displayed on the side of the Nadinaway Youth Centre building and is a collaboration with Winnipeg's graffiti art programming, also known as GAP. Basically, it, it's um, showing a really kind of strong, inspirational um, young Indigenous woman. So, um, and it's trying to highlight some of the issues, especially the young Indigenous women who have gone missing and have been murdered. Steve Wilson, the director of GAP, explains the meaning behind the mural. This piece is about hope, but it's also about bringing awareness to the issue because we need a lot of people to get involved in, in solving this issue. Nadinaway Youth Centre talent manager Corey Gregorischek says the mural can help the community. I really can't even speak to the importance that this mural is going to bring forth, uh, bringing the issue of Indigenous missing and murdered women on a global issue. It's really just doing our community a justice that is priceless. But some community members are concerned because just across the courtyard on the Indigenous Family Center building, another piece of art was vandalized, the Jackson Beardy mural. The painting was created by students in 1985 to honor the artist after his death. Wilson says this sort of thing happens from time to time. Some people are, are quick to judge and quick to go, oh, you know, they're destroying artwork and that's so terrible. But, you know, it, 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 these are just people who are trying to speak out. And Wilson says the damage to the mural will be repaired. As an homage to Jackson Beardy and those students who painted this in 1985, we're going to come and touch it up. As for Mr. Sens and his new work, he says he's learned a lot about missing and murdered Indigenous women and girls. Well, it's been, you know, it's been quite emotional. Um, so... Um, I, I've not really um, heard much about it before. It's been a very educational trip, yeah, and a trip I won't forget. Ashley Branson, APTN National News, Winnipeg.